know why some of these guys are on here. It's basically, this is how I do it. I basically put the last figures I just bought on the toy shelf and I replace what's ever there and I put it in the bin. And it kind of just rotates around, if that makes sense. But yeah, let's get started. So yeah, here is... The lighting's really bad for the top shelf. Sorry guys, I have bad lighting in my room. So yeah, there's John Cena holding <laughs> Nikki Bella. That is the elite John Cena, the new one. Probably the best one. Got Sami Zayn back there holding the European Champion. A basic Neville. A basic Owens. An elite Roman, yeah. Got Paige right there. Her first and probably only elite in purple attire. I don't know how badly. Can you guys see that? Let me... Yeah, that does nothing. But whatever, got the last... Or the latest Daniel Bryan figure that came out. He doesn't have yes hands, which is kind of disappointing. Got the new leader right there. Great likeness. Got Bailey holding the NXT belt because, in my opinion, she was the best NXT champion. Got J and J security. Is that like that? I don't know which set Rollins it is. It's the one wearing that best. Yeah. <laughs> Got. Elite. I have no idea what elite this is, but this is the one where Dean Ambrose came with the tank top, the white one. Got Macho King, Target Hall of Fame series. The Toys R Us, I think. Yeah, the Toys R Us, Bray Wyatt. I don't know if you guys can see it, but he has the red pants. So yeah. Got Charlotte with the Diva belt. Cesaro from the Battle Pack. Toys R Us at Rollins. With Paul Heyman. You got DC Icons, Green Arrow. Wonder why he's up there. Tyson Kidd Elite, which is pretty cool. Wish it was fabric though, the hood. AJ, probably her last figure for now. Unless she signs back with WWE, which I hope. You got Bray Wyatt in his rocking chair. I think that came with a battle pack accessory. And here's the bottom. Looks the lighting. Ah, my arm hurts from holding the camera. You got DC Collectibles, Arkham Origins, that stroke. Which is probably DC Collectibles' best figure in my opinion. Look how cool that looks! And it's like, well articulated. You got... which one's that? Big Barda from DC Universe. Classics. Uh, Mr. Miracle. Put them together because they're like a couple. Got Orion. Pretty disappointing figure because articulation wise. But other than that, it's a really cool scope. Look at that face. He looks angry! He's always angry! That's my secret. I'm always angry because they won't focus. Whatever. You got, oh, right here, Sasha Banks, Deadman, um, Mezco, Mortal Kombat, too bad they canceled the line because that makes no sense, but the figures are actually pretty cool. You got Black Adam from DC Icons, um, Deadstorm from uh, DC Collectibles, pretty cool from the whole Crime, Syndic um, crime Syndicate. I have all of them, but I just wanted to display him because, I don't know, I'm weird. You got Blue Beetle, Dick Grayson Batman right there from the Icons. Another KO figure. You got Arkham Knight Harley, which she was barely in the game, but still cool how they made figure. And you got two DC Icons Flash. You're probably wondering why. Holy crap, let me fix the lighting. You're probably wondering why. Well, that one right there, the ear broke, so yeah, I bought a new one. And here's a new one right here. Holy crap, stop focusing. Yeah, and here's a new one, so I got another like. Pose them looking like they're running, mirroring each other. And here's the bottom shelf. It's just like random stuff. You guys probably can't even see. Look at the camera. Got a picture of me and Laurie going to WrestleMania. Got some pops, which I don't really collect, but whatever. Two Yoda cups. Green Lantern. And yeah, let me show you guys this one pop I have. It's like supposedly super rare. I think I showed it off already. It's right there. Can I feel Right there, the Riddler one. It's retired, so I put it in the case because I'm stupid. But I don't collect pop, so I could care less about that, really, though. And here's the top shelf. It's just random ass stuff, man. You got a, what's that? WrestleMania Cesaro when he won the Andre the Giant Battle Royale, WrestleMania 30. Got Bunny. <laughs> Marvel Select Hulk. I'm gonna focus. Right there. You got Mezco Scorpion on a rock base. Some, I got that Bret Hart toy at Ross, by the way, which is kind of funny. And it comes with a leather jacket. Some random toys. I love that picture of Lori. Um, yeah, Batman, anime series Joker. Power Girl, pretty cool. And there's a Dark Knight Returns movie master Bane behind there. And some Green Lantern movie toys. So, yeah, let's get to the second shelf. This one right here is, like, even more random in my opinion. Whoa. Okay, got... Oh, shit. 
Oh, my arm's really hurling. Hurting. Hurling. What the hell's hurling? So, yeah, I got the New Day right there. Kofi showing the booty. Yeah, Adam Rose, which is actually a pretty cool elite. But too bad. He sucks ass. I shouldn't be saying that. You got the new uh, Dean Ambrose right there. You got Tyler Breeze with a selfie stick. Just kidding. It's a video camera that came with Dean Ambrose. And his, like, shield elite figure. Holy shit, man. And you got the Builder figure root. I actually like that Builder figure, even though I hate Marvel Legends. Got the Marvel Select Hulk Buster, which is way better than a, a Marvel Legends. Yeah, this is Marvel Select. Whoops, I think I said Legends for that. But yeah, got DC Collectibles, Arrow TV show, Deathstroke. Pretty cool. Got DC Universe New 52 Flash, or whatever you want to call it. Got DC Collectibles TV Flash, which is really cool. Got Season 2 Arrow. Kyle Rayner, DC Icons, uh, Green Arrow, White Lantern Arrow, Black Lantern Arrow, Green Lantern, Sign and Bass, which is such a cool character. Movie figure Sinestro, Yellow Lantern, Hal Jordan. Uh, you got Black Hand right there, you probably can't see it's too dark. Uh, British Asshole Flash, Blue Lantern Flash. It's funny because every Blue Lantern figure I ever had. If you notice, there, there's two right feet, which is kind of funny. Yeah, I'm pretty sure a lot of people had that problem with uh, DC Universe. And here's my Star Wars shelf. Pretty disappointing, because they're so hard to find these figures in store, man. So yeah, this is pretty much everything I got. Let me lower the ISO. Or let me get the light down here. Oh god, my lap falling! But yeah. Sorry about the annoying lighting. Actually, I'm not sorry. Be thankful I'm making this video. <laughs> you got Star Wars, Black Series Han Solo, who shot first. I personally think Yoda shot first, but that's my opinion. Got Princess Leia, Chewbacca, Paul Dameron, um, X-Wing Luke. Um, this is probably the best Black Series figure in my opinion. And he's really cute. You got Shell Foreign Finn, Grido, got a Resistant Trooper. He's black underneath, which is pretty cool. Baby 8 uh, Old Man Solo, Luke, Jabba, which is a really cool figure. And it's funny how like it shelf formed for years, and the movie came out, and now they're all gone. You got the bounty hunter guy right there. Uh, fuck, what's his name? Wow, my mind got blank right now. Uh, Django Fett, Django and Chain, whatever. Two Dark Vaders. That one's a Walgreens exclusive, I think. Here's the bottom. You got Kyle Ren. I'll just say Kyle Ren. You got Nightwing there for some reason. Captain Disappointing. A Sand Trooper. A Black Storm Trooper. Guavian Mexicans. You got Finn here with the Storm Troopers. And you got some of these guys right here. That figure, Commander Crowley, sucks ass. Oh, you really regret buying it. And I have one more figure to show you guys. Yeah, I don't know why <laughs> I haven't opened that yet. It's been years, but yeah. So that's pretty much been like a shelf collection video. I kind of regret making this video. I feel like it came out really bad, like quality wise. But you guys let me know, or don't let me know, because I don't really care. But yeah!